Hey folks, welcome back to Manor Lords, and boy do we have a lot to talk about. I was going to start here because I wanted to show you something important about the hunters and about deer, but then the game crashed, and crashed, and crashed, and crashed, and it has been quite a journey to get this even running again. Um, there was a crash report in the Discord that gave me a clue where to start, and then I talked to Halfwit Brit because he had also gone through a whole bunch of crashes and he filled in the final clue. He had found a field that had zero fertility on everything and it was a bad field. So he deleted it and everything started working again. So we're going to do that same thing. That one's going away. I could replant it in my, my test before I did this. I replanted it, got wheat going again and I could do it. Let's let's give that a try. We could at least eliminate that. But um, let's see here. You and that one and that one. Will it? No, I ran into that too. Let me give it some time. It doesn't want to snap. It doesn't want to even begin to place a field for some reason. And I don't know why. I don't know if it's something to do with the spot. It's something to do with the size. But all the rest of these, I, I went through. I think we ended last episode trying to get a field into here around this curve and I went through and placed a road around it and that's what it took to get it to to curve with the with the field and and look pretty good uh 100 percent one 86 percent 100 percent so I went through what was that one 86 barley that's right and so while I was doing that I placed more fields over here and you know, I just I just put fields everywhere <laughs> and I figured okay we're gonna just go for it that's what Samwise was meant for it is our breadbasket so I got eight families in there eight families in there I've got another uh, trade no another farm over here so I can get two more oxen into there we've got a total of eight oxen on their way in and three of them are going to arrive soon the all three livestock traders are off getting them right now and then the crash hit um try one more time can i nope it is not snapping i can't get in here and have it if i click once and then go away and then go away and come back now it's snapping okay now it wants to cling all right so there's a little something going wrong there doesn't like that let's just okay two points right there i wonder if it's a road issue i wonder if the road is because i think i've got two roads in here and one in here or something let's go to that point yeah now it's gripping around take you to there to there and back around and build and you follow 99 percent wheat okay we'll take it so you're going there we'll crop rotate you and I've set them all to weed on the next one because I think it's in October, it's going to bounce to the next one. And if that is sitting there at fallow, is it then going to... I don't know. So I went ahead in all of these, I think, and set it for that. I figured when October comes around, I'll go back and reassess everything and figure it out. But new fields seem to have a problem with that first rotation. Oster was like that, too. I had a lot of trouble at that very first rotation of building a field. So theoretically, it's going to roll into September. I have five crashes in a row. It would not make it to September. And it was because of the calculations right there at 0%. I believe now each time I tested it and made it work I had just clicked you know uh, fast speed I hit the X twice and it just took off and it rolled right into September no problem so there's all kinds of things happening here that I'm not paying attention to because I'm too busy doing other things but we're raining we've got 16 families plowing right now whether it's with plows or with people what are you guys? Yeah, you're, you're thinking about it. I see there's a few in every field trying to get something done. Aha. Uh -huh. So that's rolling into there. Now let's see if I can remember the whole spiel that I recorded myself saying over and over again. I finally just gave up. But over here, these guys are taking down these fields and they're pretty much done. I had set all these in between episodes and I was going to come in here and explain everything because I went through all three of the provinces and kind of rebalanced everything and got everybody where they needed to be. I also did a whole bunch with trading I want to talk to you about. But I was going to start right over here. 
because we have been seeing people dragging carcasses. In fact, let me do what I was going to do last time. Um, people and pin and people and pin and people and pin. Now, a lot of time's already gone by, but they're going out into here to go hunting. Let's, let's just watch him. There's a whole herd out here, and this is not the hunting area. And apparently that is part of the issue that is happening. This game has been created in Unreal Engine 4. Unreal Engine 5 has come out, I think, some time ago. And Unreal Engine 4, I believe, is no longer being supported. And one of the bugs that is I'm, I'm reading has been caused by that is... Yeah, he just sent off a, an arrow. And he's going to find his prey and send off an arrow because they're all heading into here and turn these guys all off we've got a see if i can find them a whole herd of deer out over here i may have just missed oh there's another one there were 20 in here i counted them i went through here before and apparently i just sideswiped them all here we go there's a whole herd of deer out in here now look where we are the deer area is over there and over here now have they migrated and, and it's not showing ooh that's what's going on the herd has migrated but the field has not the designated area needs to be over here now so that's something to do with what's happening so in the process of this whole problem and this is the problem they're addressing. The field thing wasn't even mentioned in the, the talk about the Unreal Engine 4 problem. But they're in the process, Greg the developer and whoever's helping him, is in the process of migrating the game from Unreal Engine 4 to Unreal Engine 5. And I'm a little worried about what that means because I don't believe this save created in Unreal Engine 4 is going to function and Unreal Engine 5, so we may not be finishing this series. It's I'm, I'm hoping he's going to leave a beta channel available to uh, dive into that is the old game code. And as long as I keep all these fields you know, reading properly and they can go through and, and start plowing them, we're still reading, we still are. I haven't missed one, right? They're all reading some kind of fertility. You're good. Okay, all the new fields. 100... 100. All these fields have already been, you know, tested. They, they all work. Right? We haven't hit September yet, so make sure I didn't miss anything. You, 91, 94, and 100, and 100, and 100. So I think we're going to make it through the season. It's right about now that the game would have crashed. So we're getting close to as far as I've been able to get for days. Um, so our deer over here now. So I, I I don't know if I dare move all these guys or not. I guess I could just pop some more um, wherever here and gather and meet. Pop you guys over in this direction just to get a little bit closer. Uh, red. Oh. No, those are contour lines. They're not red as in this. Okay. I just saw red and panicked a little. So the deer are definitely in this area, but there's no trees uprooted, too steep to build. Okay, there's no designation that you're going to move the deer like right here uh, will cause migration. So they have migrated somehow, and they didn't tell anybody. <laughs> so I could, yeah, we could set these guys a little closer. One of you in there. Um, we could do something like that. And it may be that I got a little... No, no, you can see the difference. I only cleared to, to expose these guys. I didn't clear into here at all. We've not been into here. We've not been into here. And... I don't think it was Gandalf that I did the back side. I'm pretty sure it was Gimli that I hit the back edge of this and cleared trees. So that wasn't it either. So we didn't invade the space. They just moved on their own. So let's set a third hunter into this area. I'll try to do it without taking out too many trees. Uh, looks like I can kind of get into 
there do that so you guys build those at your leisure we're running these they're just fine this says we have 27 so apparently it's reporting the deer that are over here so that that part's still functioning it's just not in the right location so that in the end may be a major problem that will cause crashes in the future too i don't know but we're still in august waiting for that to roll into september which will test the theory that this in fact was causing this particular crash so any of you who are having crash problems um you'll get a what surprised me when it happened was that it was crashing and give me this box you know crash to desktop big box over here all kinds of of uh, code or instructions you know as to what crashed and you know long list but I didn't notice till the third or fourth crash that it didn't say man or lords has crashed at the top it said unreal engine 4 crashed it was an unreal engine 4 pop-up it wasn't a man or lords pop-up so that finally helped me to start narrowing down what was actually going on so i think we're good well i guess we'll know when we get into september so do i dare get into the next topic let's not let's let's just play around here for a little bit till we see september yet because i have to, a lot i want to tell you about something else i'm trying out and so let's wander through let's what do we have here general storage is full and that means what you are just Tell me you're full. So what is that? You? That is you. And is that real? It is not real. Okay. Next one. They're both right here. Okay. So why it does that, I don't know. I think there was September. Ooh, we made it. So half writ Brett, thank you very much. You clued me in on that. This one now computes and it is acceptable to the game code and our 16 families are going to start putting a buttload of seed into the ground all right so over in here i know we had a couple of issues because I, I i saw them twice before while trying to record the fletcher shop had filled up and it's still basically there and the joiner shop had filled up and it's still basically there so what i did last time was i quickly put in another um family moving in good another storage house and off snap to roads and spunny around and got to thinking that back when we had this one first going i kept confusing it for a house so the upgraded version actually looks pretty house-like so i think it will look good here at the beginning of the of the boulevard i didn't want a lot of buildings that didn't look right in this entrance area to it but i think this will work and even though we've got six families running this guy click 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 it's not doing the job so we need to get some more in here so you can start building over here and i know that we got a message saying oh it didn't this time no there it is socks damage by weather so that was to do with this but they did get it in even though i never got back around here to uh hello you guys seem to no 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 pause 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 you're not going to go through so that's something that i was trying to figure out last time and i'm going to pause and talk about this it automatically rolls into the next rotation in october but when you only have one or two small fields there's plenty of time in september to get it harvested to then um um what's the word i'm looking for um till it that's what i'm trying to say or to yeah to, to break up the soil there's a word for that um to do all that and to get more seed in before we ever hit october to get to that fallow so there's a little issue here you got to kind of manually babysit this we're in fallow now right uh you and emmer yeah there's there's nothing there we're not going to plant these again so you are fallow and you are fallow and we're up and running okay so with that i can pull all but one farming family out right looks like everything that has been brought can be brought over has been brought over and i have got a whole I'll finish all the, all the camps good so that's right the farm isn't there anymore you are over here one family out you guys can can uh thresh the last of the wheat and I need to spend some time just figuring out all the noises that I've missed. Hunting caps are all done. Dare I swap everybody out? Um, 
I guess so. Man. I wonder if they can just automatically transition over. You're a no. You're a no. And there's another one over here somewhere. You are a no. Two in. And if I just shut everybody down, are you gonna, are you gonna drop carcasses? And you are what? You are hauling. So I don't know if I dare shut you down. Is there any family? Okay, hauling is transporting, transporting, crafting. You're crafting. Right there. So, transporting and transporting. Yeah, you're also transporting people. Hmm. So how do I... Actually, you're kind of... Let's take one family out of each. Maybe that will do the job. Minus you, minus and minus. That transitions others into these. And then at some point when you're in the middle of not quite, like you're just going off, you are at home doing something and you are, you're probably dragging a carcass in. No, you're not. You're peddling, but you were out there hunting way over there. So you can go. So General, you're done. You're no longer working. And I can transition one more family into... Oh, I already did. I, I swear I hit two for each. So you guys are in now. Great. So as soon as these guys are no longer crafting or hauling people... And that looks like we may be just about there. You're done. You are done. And you just have to finish your job. So as soon as crafting is finished, I can get rid of you. Oh, yeah, marathon here. So, got through the crash and figured out what it meant. That's, that's the hardest part. It's just narrowing down all of the possible activities that are happening in a game like this simultaneously. As well as, I didn't know if it was, you know, it was at the point of rolling into September. I suspected it, but there's no way to know. Because it, there's no countdown. You know, it doesn't tell me it, it, that it's September 19th right now. So, <laughs> I had no idea when that was about to happen. You're now waiting. Wow, that was crazy. Okay, so you, well, you claim you're waiting, but you're still doing the animation. Let, there you go. Nope, now you're, now you're putting the meat in here. Okay, once that's done, then it can be hauled away, and you're done. People, and gone. You're no longer. Okay, you... People. You are crafting, you are waiting to craft, and you are transporting, which usually means something to do with home. You are waiting now. Okay. And this transporting, you're probably just moving the meat into storage. No, there is a transporting happening, but I take it you are waiting for a slot. Okay, you guys may have to stay for a while. That'll be fine. So you're good. So if we're not going to use these anymore, I'm afraid I'm going to lose all the meat that's in them. So if you are down, we'll wait till all that goes away. You, in fact, we can house one or employ one family over here and get this. Wow, we need this pantry emptied. Yeah, or it's going to do us no good next berry season. Okay, so you need to empty these out so I can delete these buildings. And you, and then you're just going to run your course for a while. We apparently have three carcasses to deal with. So that this may not get done this episode. Okay, so that is over there. You guys are doing a whole bunch of things over here. Did the farm get done? It did. So new, no, that's the trading post. New farm is going in and you are the highest priority, but there's, oh, there's three families over here. So I did set a third farm to build to assist with these guys in here to get six plows up and going. And as soon as that happens, hopefully I notice it. There's two people not happy, but that's because I've got almost nobody running, uh, um, what do you call them, market stalls right now. I've got the, I've got everybody out there in, uh, in agriculture mode. Pretty much fire the whole town and get them out there to get the fields going. That's going to be Samwise's pattern. But anything else I need to do over here? I don't think so. Let's go talk to Gimli. So Gimli... Here. I had set everybody... A whole bunch of everybody's. Are we running? Yeah, we are. You guys are just taking your time. So a whole bunch of everybody's in here to get this going. Took everybody out of mining. and Except for I left one person in the well. No. In the bloomery. To try to get ahead on iron slabs a little bit. 
And otherwise we are, these are the correct fields, right? Pause. It is not. You also rolled over. Yeah. So, un or leave you paused. And what am I doing here? I want C and I want Emmer. Yeah, you guys are all dead. Okay, so manually, you are a fallow. You are... I clicked. I'll just click that one. Fallow, 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 fallow. Fallow. So it never rolled over to the next year because we haven't found an October yet. So that is an issue when you don't have a lot to do. Now they could get this all plowed and ready for next time. I don't know if the fertility continues to increase when it's in the plowed state. I don't know if by plowing it you break a you know a, a pattern of a code or something. You guys are supposed to be the next fields to be done. Flax, no emmer, and we are for the most part back again. So let's go ahead and set you guys going. So fallow is now wheat, and you're going to roll over to wheat. So this is where it gets a little tricky. So you're wheat, but in October it's going to roll to this one. So I want to make sure it also says wheat so they don't just stop October 1st and go back to whatever and, and we never get planted. So that's there. Dare I set any more fields and see if any of them go to zero? Because we do have this whole area here I was going to do next, but that's what got me into trouble last time. I'm going to, I'm just going to let you guys run. So over here, um, we're taking these fields down, and we need to make sure that you guys have followed out too. Okay, followed out. So everything has been taken down, fallow. So there's a lot of manual work right now. I don't think it would have mattered in in Samwise though, because I don't think they would have started plowing and seeding any of these fields yet because there's so many other fields to deal with so i'm pretty sure they're, they're still just finishing up here there's still a, a percent left crop growth right there 99 percent so they won't start plowing and plowing that's the word i was looking for before um plowing and seeding until every field has been harvested i did notice that last time so problem is when the other two places have only two or four fields that happens really quick so I can't even turn you off yet. So what fields over here were being done? You and you and you. Just the three? Your wheat. Okay. And not you. And there weren't any over here. This is all brand new. So it was these three, these three, and these five. So I need to come back here soon and catch Fallow. You're... Wait a minute. No, you're... You're... Wait, 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 wait. Barley. You? Yeah, you have to be caught, and you're just finished. Okay, follow you. <sighs> Am I right? See, and uh, that is barley. Yeah, these three are done. These are starting. So once again, fallows, 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 barleys, barleys, barleys. Okay, so they're going to work on these three, and that should be 16 families worth minus... Four working well <laughs> somebody lost their ox over here and somebody lost their ox okay um, I'm, I'm really curious now what's happening here now wow I, I so are you 100% no you're 85% and you're you're both yeah okay Farming has some problems right now. I'm just going to put that out there. I wonder if this would go faster. It just might. Without the oxen. I wonder if heavy plow is really having trouble. Because we've got two heavy plows following each other with a single ox. Where are the oxes right now? The oxens. Oxen? Yeah. I'm pulling a half wit bread there. <laughs> Oh, we've got a rasm once in a while. He 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 let off oxes on one of his episodes, and I, I just I had to politely point it out. Of course, I have said it too. We we all have. Oxen is just not a word that we use in our normal vocabulary. You are plowing, and you are walking. Okay, and where was I? Let's go to this one. You are plowing. Boom. And you are walking. 
So, what the heck are you guys doing? You're just pretending. And you really don't know what you're doing. But I see he's in training. He's the apprentice. Oh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm, yeah. Or he's, he's muscle building. That might be it, too, because that's not easy to do. Oh, they swap places. Look at that. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm going to get out of here, but they seem to be working. Except, it's right, we're work, We're waiting on this one. I'm trying to... You are fallowed out completely. You are fallowed out, and you are fallowed out. All right, so you're going to be wheat next time. You're going to be wheat, well, two times, and you're going to be wheat. Just remind me what that was for. You are also needing to fallow, but become wheat later. Okay, so construction, emmer. So these are all done for the year. We're working on all those, all of those, all those, all of those, including you. Uh, pasture. No, that's that's not a pasture. That's Oh, it's a pasture. Okay, words are, are sinking in slowly. That means animals. Okay. Anyway, you and Emmer and Barley. There we go. And I just, I have to keep repeating myself just to make sure I haven't lost it. You are committed, but you're going to roll over and, and stay committed. You are still being sown. You are still being... Okay, so that one's grayed out because it's already planted? No, because they started planting. Okay, so we have these three left to do this one. It needs a little bit more... Nope, you are done. You're just not showing it. Otherwise, we are getting the rest of all of these done. Okay, where am I, by the way? I'm about a half hour into this, thereabouts. So, you guys, when you're done, I need to get you guys off doing other things soon. But, yeah, you got work to do ahead of you. And you guys don't have anything to do at all farming-wise. You're done. We only have the two fields. There's no fertility left. Just waiting for that to be done, and it's done. You guys are all back. And what are you doing? You are building this. You have built it. Three families right in. No, two families into there. Leave one family left. Nobody. Yeah, you guys can run things. You can run booths. Okay. So that should help alleviate some of these issues here with three, two more families collecting goods. And actually, I could just click, 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 get you set and up, up and upgrading. Okay, so I think I can walk away from you, and I think you aren't ready for me to deal with you yet. Whew, so I can get on to the next subject, which is a big subject. Something, so end of last episode, I was said I was going to just kind of roll through here and do all the things I don't have time to do when I'm recording. I'm too busy trying to catch up with this and catch up with that, and the timer is always against me, and these guys are... An animal ran away? Whoa, 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 what? An animal ran away? Um, what? An animal ran away. Okay, that's new to me. That's really new. You are a farmhouse, and you are saying that the work area is empty. What am I looking at here? You. You. A logging camp. I had that up, and I clicked on that, and I saw that. Is that what happened? I don't know what happened. I'm, I'm okay. I'm, yeah. <laughs> I need a vacation. Um, logging camp is having a problem with nowhere to find logs. I told them to go clear out over here. I did. And are your animals still here by any chance? Just out of curiosity. They've moved. Oh, so it's not just a Gandalf thing. All of the deer are migrating. Okay, the deer have unionized, and they are all doing their own things now. So I have no idea where to be mowing down trees anymore. I are you guys over in here? Are there any deer? Because I'm going to take trees out over here if there are no deer around. Okay. Oh, 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 don't you do that. Yeah, the saves are going to freak me out now. I wish there was a quick save button. I can't hit F5 and make this thing a quick save. I don't think. That's just out of curiosity. Um, can I do that from here? Controls. 
Uh, controls. Key bindings. Is there any kind of a save or quick save in here? Unassigned show. If you guys see it, let me know. I am not seeing the word save popping in anywhere. Yeah, that's not there. So, okay. I think, actually, I could do this. Although it's going to freak me out. But I could, where is that? Gameplay? Gameplay, let's take you to five minute auto saves. Maybe that will salvage things if there's if there's another bug in the game I haven't caught. Maybe something to do with the deer migrating. Anyway, you need a new place to go so I can go do something else that's a lot more important. So let's just Hmm. Let's just wipe out this area over in here for now and we'll replant over here. Did we ever put a forester in this area? We did not. Let's just do one real quick. You and Gather and Forester's Hut. And you look like a wonderful place to put one. Please, please, please. There. Pop you in and you'll get built next and I'll never notice it. And eventually I'll put a family in there. Okay. So anyway, in between episodes, I went through all the farming and found all new places to put fields. And did this happen? This did happen. And bang, bang. I'll put all three in. So three more families, and no, that wasn't the whole, that wasn't the point. Well, okay, for this time, it'll be the point. Three families are going to go in and assist with the rest of this. Is that what I want to do? Is that what I want to do? Because I got four plows running, and we're already started in all the fields that are going to be done. It's these three, these three, and these five. These are all done. They just need to plant them. And four plows are already up and going. Okay, we'll just do. We'll just use the families. Okay, so is there anything else that I've been desperately needing to do? I don't think so. Before I get into that next topic, um, I want you, right? Yeah. So trade. We have our eight oxen in in the house now. I don't know where they are, but they're there and they're available somewhere. Okay. So one of the things I decided to do was to take a look at trading and just really kind of I guess you'd say normalize it go through all of the traders and make sure that this this town that has extra is putting them out there and this town that needs it is asking for it and that sort of a thing so Gimli's going to be over here and Samway is going to be over there and if I can find my way through here Gandalf is going to be over here and what I started to do is I went through and hit trade and I just started going through the one by one and it kind of dawned on me what if because there is an option we've not played with before called full trade so we have import export and full trade which means moving in and out is important export added together to maintain what you're asking for 50 so what if we did a whole bunch of in-house stuff so um Where's an example? Well, for starters, Gimli is desperately needing roofing tiles. We only had enough stocks are exposed. I wonder if I should pause it right here. I'm going to pause it in the background. So I don't know what's happening back there. And this could take 10, 15 minutes to explain what I've done. So we are, we are not. We're not pausing. There we are. We're paused. Um, Samwise is going to be selling roofing tiles. That's going to be their major income source. So I left it at all, allow foreign trade. But it does still trans, transfer out to other towns that have do not allow foreign trade. In other words, they will buy from them and foreigners will buy from them. Everybody can buy from them. But foreigners are not allowed to touch the stocks of Gandalf and the stocks of Gimli. So because... Samwise is selling it in, on purpose. These two had just a, a limited amount of clay. So they made what they could, and that's kind of where they run out. But tier three housing and maybe some other things later are going to need roofing tiles. So I need to make sure that they always have it available. What I decided to do was just to turn full trade on just about everything in the game. So I went through full trade for everything that all of our three provinces are going to need and they can just swap back and forth amongst themselves at that lower rate of seven, six, eight, 
855, except for things that they need to be selling outside of, like small shields. We're not using any small shields. So they can all make them, and they can all sell them. And so I left foreign trade on on those. But all the rest, as, as um, Gandalf has too many large shields, and now apparently um, Gimli, where's the name right there, Gimli, has too many, they can be getting rid of them. In fact, they all really have... No, well, actually, you don't. So, Samwise, I wanted to keep 30 in stock. So, they can start buying from either Gimli or Gandalf. And there's ten, there's 18 extras over here that they could come and grab. Or there's 33 extras over here they can come and grab. But, you know, they may not have enough war bows, and, and they do, and vice versa. Rather than specifically having to assign a pack station to go and move over until I remember to shut down war bows because they only needed 15 of them or to go and set it up here in the traders and then you know until there's a certain number now if we have a major battle and we did like last time and wipe out all but eight of Gandalf's spearsmen then as we run out of spears trying to fill everything back up again or run out of large shields, they can just automatically be absorbing from whoever has too many over in another town. You know, we just move supplies around as we need them rather than have to very specifically target who needs this, who needs that, micromanage everything. So everything now is on full trade, especially things like the crafting materials. That's huge. Who has too much linen? Who has not enough linen? So right now, that's probably a bad example, but um, hides. So actually, hides is another bad example. I didn't do anything with that. But um, okay, herbs, there we go. We know herbs actually are a functioning item in the game now. So let's try to keep 20 herbs in, in stock at all time. And whoever doesn't have enough versus whoever has too many can start grabbing herbs from each other until we can normalize everything. Or maybe 10 is, is a more appropriate number because herbs are pretty slow in uh, generating. So we'll do that. Everybody needs 10 in stock for those who get sick. So Gandalf is already set. And uh, Samwise has four extras, so Gimli can head over there and grab four, so they've got at least four in stock. And so, just kind of work my way through their clay. Who's got extra clay? So, now, you'd think, okay, now, they are using that clay, did I just go to the wrong one, to make their roofing tiles. And so we don't want to take their clay, so because that's their income. But, you know, they're going to be making it continually, and as they need some I said let's maintain 50 in each one well they can go grab a few of theirs they're still making plenty and as they need a few well we can go over and grab some of them as well it gives them an income whether it's from clay or from roofing tiles they're still going to be selling either to us for clay or to uh, to outside foreign traders for roofing tiles so everybody gets some income moving in and moving out but they nobody is bankrupt of any of the important basic materials so all the foods now even though Gimli is going to be turning these foods these berries into dyes that's going to be one of their major trade goods and I want that to be available for them to be able to generate an income there as Gandalf or Samwise starts to use too many berries and maybe depletes some of their of their stocks while they're trying to make those those dyes um, as we get into the next season, they'll be grabbing back from these two to get their, their dye production working again. And I think it'll all balance out pretty well in the end. So that is my, we'll call it insider trading experiment. We'll let our own provinces have whatever is excess in any of the other provinces and just move goods around with hopefully a full, as, as we get done with the, uh, we're in Gandalf. Let's move over to Gimli for the lettuce. I can find Gimli. Um, there, Gimli. We have two families available. Let's move one more into here. Oh, that just upset the cart. As we get into out of the, the planting season, we will move peoples around, turn the game back on, and make sure that the trading uh, posts are all up and running. Here is Gandalf. So Gandalf has only one person available, so that's no good. But as... 
we get into get out of the growing season. I'll make sure those are fully stocked and make sure that there are as many um, horses or mules, horses, available. And we'll just see how they just constantly move goods back and forth through all of the, uh, all the provinces and kind of hit everybody's minimum needs so that all of the, the different artisans and, you know, malt houses and weavers and that sort of thing can all continue to function as, as we go. So that is the great experiment, the great insider trading experiment. Maybe I will call it that. Otherwise, we are in September. That scared me. Saving finished. And you guys are all trying to do all this. Do I get another two oxen up and going? That is the question. We're still in September. We still have lots of time. We do. It's just a matter of getting all the plowing done and so we can start start throwing seed out. And I think we're pretty much done for all of these fields. So you, 100%. I'm pretty sure this is the only one over here that is still at the 90-some, 80-some percent. You have a little space royal tax increase. Every interruption like that is going to scare the bejeebies out of me. They can, I'm a little gun-shy now from all the crashes. And storage is full from the saw pit. And it's real. Okay, so that means we can just shut you down. Logging, saw pit. Actually, we built the other one just for this purpose. Move you on over. So we could do that. Although, Gimli... No, we've got... Uh, we've got 31 households over here. Wow, we're doing pretty good in Gimli. So, but we have only one family available. Do I... What am I using planks for right now? Planks, except for upgrades, which we do want to deal with but we are using planks to make small shields to sell there is that and we did open up that route advance we're waiting for one more oxen over here so what did we lose over here let's go back to that while it's still available so and we didn't lose anything else there's no bandit camp that showed up while i was doing all that talking right um exposed goods in the field and samwise Families needed to do things. An animal ran away was here. I think that was the other ox. I had asked for another ox to come in. Let's see here. Trade. Four. We have an extra horse for some reason. And I don't know why. So trading. Oh, that was... Yeah. Trade. Advanced. Asking for that one. So it says we have two. And then... The oxen. So we have places for them. Right? Uh, over here. We have five of six. So there's plenty of room. We should certainly build a few more just to get those built. But um, can I... I can't click on anything, right? Um, ran away. Right there. So it just shows us this. From here, livestock. You are over there. And you are over there. So the two that are showing as part of the trading post now why does it show that let me, let me let me think here you trading post advanced there's no animals livestock there's two so are they living here is that what it's trying to tell me that we only have two that might be what it's trying to tell me so let's go to logistics let's let's pop a bunch more of these in so I, maybe we only have two and we have more animals than we have the two that might be a thing can't I fit you in here? I can. So we've got one there, and you're feeding out of this side. So if I put you further down over here, and you're feeding out of that side. So where's a nice little spot in here? Right there. And then we could road kind of into here and curve down into there. I like that. Okay, so you're going to get built, and let's get one of you at highest priority just to get one done. But let's get another one or two of those in so we don't we never run into that problem again. Where else would logically this seem right? There's a bunch of stuff going on here. But I don't think anything here uses oxen. Not oxes. Oxen. But we do have need over in this area. Now, I did build one. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, one's over here. That was moved from the other side. Okay. So, you are the forester. You seem like a really good place. You do. Yeah, you're going right over there. So there's that one. You don't have to build too fast. 
And this is where we will assign a family, if we aren't already. We are now. So there is room for one. So why are two supposedly living in the livestock trader? So that might be an issue. Because we're not calling for one. So that might be a little problem in the code as well. You should be bringing them in and then transferring them to wherever. And this claims that there is a space left over here yet. Right. Lost you. There. So over in here at Livestock is the horse, of course. The <laughs> horse, of course. That needs to be used clear over here. That's a hike. Um, another save. So saving every five minutes is going to stop my heart every five minutes. You should probably then move over so we can put the horse that lives inside you over here next to the trader. I think so. So you're over here and spin you around. You are opening from um, that direction. I think I've reversed the other one. Okay, let's leave a space in case I want a road in between up through here, which seems like something I had better do because there's no road from all the way from over there. So road and there, up into like that. So it is possible, I think I mentioned this already, but then I've started this episode twice. So maybe I haven't. So deja vu moment. But actually I've started this episode four times. But um, it's possible that the series is going to die on me. We are migrating to Unreal Engine 5. I don't know what happens after that. I'm hoping I can shut down the update somehow and continue. But I don't know that we're going to see this series to a completion. So just kind of prepare yourselves for that possibility. And know that we, we did get a pretty good run into this thing. There is that. I mean, we got a, a lot done. And we've seen almost everything. The only thing we haven't seen is for the Baron dude to attack one of ours. And I believe Halfwit Brit has an episode coming up. Yeah, he's he's pre-recording several of them, and he's heading off on vacation. So I think he had that experience. So keep an eye on his channel next week, and I think you're going to find an experience like that is going to show up. I don't know how it happened or any of the details about it, but I'm definitely going to be watching. So I'll let, I'll let him go through the experience first, and I'll have a clue what I need to do. How are we doing over here? We have one, two, three, four, five, six. 11 fields you know we're in october now so let's let's think about this let's grab one family back out and then let's do this and add the plow station and you are the highest priority and see how quickly that can actually be done it's probably not going to get done in time that one family was probably all the way out there and they're probably going to have to come all the way back and find a spare ox somewhere drag a log or something over what does it actually take where am I? Uh, that was you. Yeah. So you, just one log. So one log over and then bang, 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 and it's done. So if I notice that. So I think I've talked about everything that I needed to talk about. And now it's just a matter of just seeing things happen. But we've moved a lot of product around with that new trading system. Let's take a peek at that real quick. We should see inside the trading posts the fruit of that. We are moving things out to be distributed and people trading. Peter is moving something out there and it looks like he's moving it to Gimli. Yeah, he's taking the road across. So he's heading off to Gimli to go pick up something or drop off something. That's good to see. Let's grab the other. There's two. There's two in each of these and one in that one. Okay. So you have only dealt with planks right now. Trading. One is trading and one is trading. And you are over here trading, it looks like. And you don't know where you are. So let's pin you. So Ditz, you are over here. And you click away there. i got to click away. There we are. And now it'll show me that you're trading. If you just keep following, you don't get this pop-up. But, yeah, trading doesn't really help us. Viet, where are you? You are on your way, and you've got a stowaway in your cart, just to let you know. Off to Gimli as well to go and trade out something. Okay, Gimli, what are your traders doing, or are they doing anything? You guys, you got three families in here. You have moved some iron ore over. 
So you've got lots of extra iron ore because we are making that. And iron ore is 145 and we're only asking to keep in stock iron ore uh, 100. So 45 have moved over here to be to be uh, moved over to, I think I said it for, for Gandalf only. And because Gandalf does have the bloomery going and is... So Gandalf and Gimli can all kind of share iron ore since they're both kind of in the iron business just to make sure that everyone's got at least a hundred going so the bloomeries can keep going so that production can continue without any delays and there was a whole bunch of, of noises happening there uh forester that's all gimli's uh yeah so forester's hut okay yep yeah, small stable yep yeah, moved i'm guessing hitching post yeah that's the new one and clothing stall, and I'm looking to see if the farm was upgraded. Did not. So, people in Gimli, and we have a trader, and we have a trader. Okay, so, pin you, get rid of you. You are trading, and you are heading off to Samwise, I'm guessing. Conrad is heading up to, Gim to Gandalf, and Bartholms is on his way out to Samwise. Looks like it. And so they're just swapping goods all over the map now. I think that's going to be a winner. I think that is going to be a tactic that is 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 comparable to the semi maneuver. That's 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 what that's the level of fame I'm going for. Though I've got to say the semi maneuver saved my butt. So I don't know if if I can uh, if I can uh, you know claim that level of fame. That was that was a pretty good move. But this is. I think going to revolutionize the idea of trading, of insider trading. Now, a thousand gold, there's another issue. Two thousand gold, so we're moving a lot of stuff. Are we going to bankrupt anybody? 65. Now, Gimli needs a lot of stuff, but Gimli also has a lot of stuff to offer. So we're, we're, we've got more berries than everybody else. We've got more iron ore than everybody else. We have shields to sell. So as they bankrupt themselves and can't buy any more things they'll hopefully then just kind of rotate around and find some things they can deal with which is selling what they've got available to sell which should cycle some more funds back in so i think we're going to be okay we're not asking for any taxes over here right taxes no we've left them alone and we're going to leave them alone as far as the tithe as well so we'll just we'll, they're still a baby town and we'll let them let them you know keep their training wheels on for a while and, and help them out um while we have 65 it might be nice to set some more um eggs and what have you in here um leathers are fine i don't need to deal with goats but out of meat and we're living on berries right now so yeah let's get some more i can get two more two more um chickens in so i think i did all these in chickens except this last one so let's set you for chickens before those those monies are gone and then this group up here all of you guys can be or a bunch of you can be chickens as well so you can be chickens and we're broke so we're not buying any more but we will be selling and i could do another vegetable for 15 but don't have a vegetable area set up so how are we doing over here as far as we we rolled over okay so make sure that so we rolled over it had said wheat wheat fallow we rolled into it so we maintained the wheat that i believe if i had said fallow it would have shifted this to fallow correct me if i'm wrong if they already had seed in them maybe that would have not happened but those that did not already have seed in them very well might have uh i don't know might have maintained might have crashed i don't know you guys let's just verify all that happened here i did double up on them so the barley that was here rolled over the fowl that was down there rolled up so next time we'll be fowl like it's supposed to be okay so is there anything not planting you foul it out on me were you supposed to so no you were not supposed to you're supposed to be wheat so let's just see that again all these were supposed to be done um right i'm pretty sure uh you and that would have been barley 
and they're, they're green. These guys are supposed to be planting. So I'm going to have to manually go through and just verify that everything is right. These are supposed to be barley right now. Barley, barley with fallow afterward. You guys are supposed to be wheat right now. You are, you are, and you already started. And you are, and you already started. Okay. Uh, you guys are supposed to be barley? Barley. No. A barley and two wheats. Yeah. And you are still barley, and you're planting. You're wheat, and you're planting. You're wheat, and you're planting. So the rotation system is a bit janky. You do need to keep up with that. Now, we just cleared out these three, these five, and three of these somewhere. So I need to verify. Uh, save. Whew. Okay. Get the heart going again. So fallow barley, fallow barley, fallow barley. Barley fallow, barley fallow, barley fallow. Good. And you are still fallow flax. Yes, 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 yes. And you are flax fallow. Yes, 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 yes. And you are wheat fallow, wheat fallow, and wheat fallow. And you are fallow wheat, fallow wheat, fallow wheat, and fallow wheat. Okay, let her run again. A few things to fix there. So yeah, those ones that did swap and the other ones that did not swap. I would imagine what that would have amounted to was next year just this mammoth mess of some that worked properly, some that did not. Maybe would not have caused a crash. Just would have been randomized on me. All right, you are maxed out. I have no idea if there are any animals still. The animals are still here. Okay, and what are you? You're a bunch of green rocks. Interesting. Yeah, a whole bunch of moss-covered rock in here. Pretending to be deer. Cool. So let's see if we can't send somebody into there. There's nothing building over here anymore, right? Did we get it done? Did No, we did not. Okay, well. Mm, who else can I pull out? You guys are going to hate me for it, but let's pull one of you out. And let's pull one of you out. Okay. So less goods are getting distributed. This is going to suffer. And for that matter, let's help you guys out a little bit right now by pulling taxes down. By, well, by pulling taxes down to five. Let's give you guys a break. We're doing great. We can handle the king's tax many times over now. So you're going to go down to five. That did hold, right? Make sure clicking away didn't. Yeah, didn't lose it. Let's do the same thing with Gandalf. I had set you rather extreme at one point too. Though you're you're handling it. You are um, taxes. Let's take you down to five, and we'll set you to a ten tithe. You two are mature enough to handle it and, and keep it going. But we're good there. We are two thousand in coinage over here we're at 16 in coinage over here they're doing great we are still at 15 over here so you guys are going to need a little more help and i may need to spend some time although saying i'm going to work on the game but in between episodes that didn't go so well last time but i need to get another trader in here both trader traders will duplicate each other so really it's just like adding two farms they will both do the same job that was a click. I didn't... Hmm. don't know what that little noise was. I heard something. But I wanted to put a second trader somewhere. I thought about doing it out over here. Because a lot of the storage is over here. I did this over here. I'm not exactly sure why. I guess because I didn't know what was happening over here. But let's do set a trader over here. Coins and trader. And you're up in here. I have not, I've been setting them all to the King's Road just to make sure there is no little bug in that regard, but I think I'm going to not this time and just make sure that's okay. I kind of like that little, what do you call this thing, this, yeah, that little, yeah, I, that, whatever that is, the name has escaped me, but I'm not going to put that road in. When I put the road in to the last one that wasn't right on the mode road, it then said, hey, you're not connected to the King's Road, even though I had put it in. So I'm going to wait till it tells me that I'll connect it, because it doesn't seem to accept connections prior to building. But you can get, get built. I did put in another of these, and I moved the other one uh, right over here. So let's get you upgraded. And is there already somebody? It's not going to tell me. 
too late. Uh, moved you, saw pit, and you're starting to fill up, and you're already click, 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 filled up. Let's take the family out. We're just, we're filling this up and we're not really using it. Which is surprising. I guess because we don't have anybody really working the large storehouse in quantity to keep bringing planks over here. There's nothing there. So that you can be using them. Joiner, general, and no planks. So it's happening really, really slowly. So we'll wait till we have we can get planks brought over to this side. And let's see. One last thing to touch up on. I want to verify something. I had a comment come in and a little confusion about something that the tier three houses can in fact handle or use gambesons and I, apparently i was wrong two of zero okay i was wrong um because i had looked before and it was i thought it was red zero of zero on the level threes level twos are happy no 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 here we go Apparently it's reversed. It's not two of, it's of two. So two of two green in a level two. In a level three, gotta hit the ground. It's three slash zero. Zero have been accepted over here. It's not red. Okay, red means they need it, but they don't have enough. Okay, gray means they can't use it at all. So, but it says there's, okay, am I, Am I reading this wrong? I'm willing to stop and, and question myself. Three of zero. Does that mean they're actually wearing them, though it's not calling for any? It's a weird way of designating it. It really is. Have they not taken them off because they don't have chain mail to put in their place? Is that the answer? That might be. Okay. Let me reverse for the fourth time in the last three minutes. <laughs> Apparently they can use them, but they do not call for them. Is that what I'm interpreting here? So they are, th th these three families had used them from back when they were a level two and they didn't toss them even though they became a level three because they don't have anything to replace them with yet. Okay, I'm going with that one. And final answer, Regis. And with that, I better shut this down. I'm at that hour mark. So thanks for watching, folks. It's been a crazy episode, and I will catch you next time. Bye-bye now.